All right, everyone. So this week's challenge was a whole interview situation. And so we decided that it didn't really make sense to do it after the chop. So I just want to talk to you real quick. Um, we have your season one winner. We have judges Miss Miranda and St. Mark's. So tell me real quick about what you guys thought about the night. I thought it was very gaggy. There was so much shade, girl. That had a, so much shade. Who is this? <laughs> Literally. <laughs> what the hell are they wearing? It was so much shade, girl. So oh, I'm no. feeling my Kenya Sanchez oats right now. Which is weird because you look like Kevin Federline. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not wrong. I would say uh, actually a lot of fun tonight. It was it was gaggy. It was fun. It was in good spirits. It was for me. I thought it was I thought it was a great reunion, which we didn't have season one. Um, I enjoyed it actually. It was fun. Mm -hmm. Say Mark. Really. Fun. All that nice. Shit. I live for the cuntiest, shadiest, queeniest <laughs> moments, bitch. Give us what we're looking for, because at the end of the day, the audience, nor myself, is sitting here to hear a Miss America pageant answer, and that's that on that. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Uh, listen. Oh, uh, it's like when you said um, the first girl was supposed to be asked, "Who do you think does not deserve to be in the top four? And she goes, "I'm gonna ask it a little bit differently." <laughs> Who do you believe, with the tools in their toolbox, does not have the proper requirements to build the tool shed? Bitch, And it's bye. not their fault that they can't build right. the tool shed. They I were born <laughs> without the nails. Go <laughs> by. I quite literally don't know what you're talking about. Next week, I will be out of town. Lola Madison is going to oh, uh, be hosting, and she will get all the shade from this week all and next shade. week. Yeah. So nobody went home today anyway, so you didn't miss a whole lot. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I'm Amber Valentine, and this has been After the Chop. Bye.